every time. Uh, we don't do no cap. Report only facts. Crackers report. We got the news. Knowing the views. We got the stats. Keep it a rack. Don't join the pack. It's your boy Lil Loaded, motherfucking block baby. And we here on the Progress Report. Get over with your boy. The Progress Report. Alright, what's going on? This your girl Lala Shepard. This is the Progress Report. Boss Brit the most lit. What's up? It's your girl DJ Excel. Hey man, we got our first guest in the building. Go to introduce Lola. yourself. Y'all locked in with the block baby right now. We trying okay. to from Dallas, Texas. Hey, yeah, Dallas, Texas, Texas, Texas going crazy, boy. Y'all yeah, got some we shit. Lit right now. We lit right now. Y'all got some Young shit. Niggas, I'm turning this shit over the top. Definitely, man. Young niggas, how old are you? 19. Young, oh, 19. Oh, you're a little baby. You're a little boo-boo. Okay. With a whole neck tag. <laughs> oh, right. oh, yeah. Are you big round? He said, nah, don't play with me, though. Okay. That's what's up. Okay. That's what's up. Yeah, I was going to say, man, you just said that Black Baby, uh, that shit went crazy. Would you say that's your first, like, breakout song? Yeah, that was my own, that was my second song. Oh, okay. your second song ever? Yeah. Shit. Yeah, that's crazy. I only been rapping for eight months. Damn, okay. Damn, nigga. So what was it about that single that just went crazy, like, that I you feel the, like made it I think crazy. the energy, like, you can feel like it's real. Like, man, ain't doing no mm. cabin or that. Like, you can feel the, the genuine energy in it and just the beat just cool. crazy. Mm -hmm. True. That's what's up. I can't that. say though. Sometimes people get so caught up um, in like lyrics and stuff, but energies of songs gives a whole feeling too. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It's not, um, and not just talking about your song. I'm just saying in general, like some of these songs that like they just turn up in the song, those go way bigger than somebody that might be like, you know, whatever. You know what I'm saying? It ain't just about the lyrics, it's about the feeling they give it as well. Yeah, it's right. like, who, like, it don't, like, it don't matter what you're saying if you don't make nobody want to listen to it. Like, Facts. Mm. Your energy will make people want to listen to it. That's not sure. How you be shaking your dress when you perform? I don't really be shaking my dress. Like, you don't? See, I want I dresses to shake them up. I be jumping like too much. My shit just shake. I, mean, <laughs> I just want them just to shake them just Brit like that. Brit be trying to shake. Let's see. <laughs> my shit love. It's a little stiff. Let's say that. You got your, uh, your on your uh, frulu. <laughs> nah, I got the ethics on today. Frulu's coming soon. Okay. Hey, you funny as hell. I'm your page getting weak. I'm talking about, hey, them frulu's. 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 All right, we'll talk about coming up in Dallas, man. Well, you originally born in Cali, right? Yeah. All right. Talk about that, that upbringing. So I was born in San Bernardino, so like, it's a, it's a city, you know what I'm saying? So you see different shit and, see, and you go through different stuff. But shit, I moved to Dallas when I was like 10 and shit, that's still the city. Pretty teen. Going through the same shit, but still, you know, I shit, that made me that made me who I am today. Y'all wouldn't have a black baby without it. So I fuck with it. You know uh, walk us through the Dallas like music scene, especially for the young guys right now. Shit, hey, if you gonna rap, it's your time to do it if you're from Dallas. Mm. Nigga, no, we ain't had Dallas no spotlight. Dallas going crazy. Yeah, we ain't had no spotlight for a minute. For I, sure. We, we admit that, but we going crazy now. Yellow Beezy, Trap Boy, Freddie, mm. me. Shit, you can add Fort Worth in there, too, because we so close. Right. But CJ Casino, you yeah, know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout CJ. Dallas hot right now, real hot. Mm. So it's like, we appreciate it, and it's fun for me to be a part of the movement and help progress my city. Okay, progress. Keyword. Keyword. Okay, you get uh, brownie points for that. So, um, talk about just getting yourself hot. Really, it was an accident. Mm. Eight months. That's yeah, crazy. I was just, I was just rapping. Like, mm. I was just, like, I always, like, everybody told me I used to go hard and stuff, freestyling. Mm. And then I was, like, I'm gonna get in the booth and drop something. Dropped it. Went to the hood. Shot the video on a normal day. That was a crazy day. Right. Honestly, happened. But I dropped it and. Tommy Craze, that's my partner now, but mm. when he when he reacted to my video, I ain't know him. Like, we cool now, we real close. But he reacted to it and it went dumb. Like he reacted to it the night, the night it dropped, so I ain't even get a chance to get no views on it before he reacted to it. Mm. And mm. then it did what it did. How do you think you get a reaction out of somebody like him, you not having that connect? Like how do you think it got to him? Oh, it just he he do a little series where he do uh Reactions with zero views, reactions to videos with zero views. And because oh. I had just dropped it like mm. minutes before, it, yeah, mm. I had no so views. Oh, so that's crazy. Like, okay. Yeah, I'm just trying to think how he came across yours though. But that's dope to bring life to something Fact. before. Because mm -hmm. sometimes people jump on stuff after this yeah. buzzing. Been popping. You know? and, then, and like really be on board with it. Because yeah. like we did a lot of stuff. I got a whole music video with a minute. I flew to Australia wow. to do that. Mm. Wow. Nice. And like, I hit my partner. Like, like, mm. him, like he, it's, it's genuine energy. You feel me? That's hard. You ain't got to be no tough nigga to be to hang with me. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Sure. It's was that the um, Black Baby joint or just something different? Huh? That was the joint that he shared for you, or like Black Baby was the one that he uh, 
that 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 he first reacted to that blue okay. mm -hmm. but he still he reacted to a lot of my stuff like okay. he like he really enjoyed my music so he that's what's up fuck with me Oh, um, talk about that flight to Australia, though. How long was that? <laughs> I know that shit was <laughs> long, boy. Tom Hanks in Australia right now at the coronavirus. Well, hella koalas. <laughs> uh, <laughs> koala bears. And wild fires. <laughs> and wild fires, right? When this shit wow. So talk about that flight, though. I know that shit was long. Well, I had to fly from Miami to Dallas, mm. from Dallas to oh my God. LA. Oh, that's and, a long day. And then 18 hours from LA oh, to wow. Australia. Oh, wow. No. It's the longest flight you could take in the world. Yeah, that's a fact. 18. Was that your first time out the country? Yeah. Yep. Okay, so we'll talk about that experience, like just being outside of the U.S. It was crazy. <laughs> lucky for like, lucky for me, like people out there spoke English, mm -hmm. like, and and they were real cool. Like everybody out there, it felt like New York really to me. Okay. Like, it felt like a, it was busy room. like that. Yeah, like people walking down the street, all types of stuff like that. I felt like a New York to me. It was a cool little vibe. Y'all got streets. I'm thinking about kangaroos and uh, <laughs> grass uh, and shit. See, I was in. Uh, <laughs> Been out of the country, but it's just more so we <laughs> haven't been to Australia yet. I, was, yeah, I ain't been to Australia been yet. Yeah. <laughs> nah, I only been to Australia. Like okay. I was in Melbourne, though. That's the city part. Okay. Okay. Like, okay. You go to other places and see kangaroos, though. That's so dope. Why, you got why, some shorties out there? Nah. No shorties? <laughs> Damn. Nah. So why did... Um, <laughs> heard they got some good gas out there, though. Why no. did y'all do that? No. <laughs> Bad week. Oh, why did y'all do that in Australia? Cause, like, I wanted to go see him, meet him myself, because he, oh. like, he did, like... You know he did he did so much for me and like, I was connected like we was talking like hanging out you know I mean talking like we talk to each other and like just come up with different ideas and stuff so I was like shit I gotta meet him like he cool that's what's yeah. up that's hard how's that's the music up. scene out there though right he like you what know music it's scene? like you know it's like they got some they got some they got some music out there though yeah, yeah. they do got some music out they there okay yeah they got some they got some trap got shit. Some, some, yeah. Yo, See, niggas yo, outside the U.S. love trap music. That I, is true. Uh, yeah. man. That's true. Cause, Including me. I love trap. That's true. Because like, I know my song, Gang Unit, uh, mm. streamed 45 in Norway. Oh, like, wow. That's crazy. That's hard. Yeah, number 45. So I'm like, damn. That's crazy. Gang. Probably would never expected that. Yeah. yeah, that's dope as hell, though. That's what's up. But you learn that they want to... Um, Live through your experiences. Yeah, and which that's you right. See, and I, I fuck with that shit. I got a lot of experience telling niggas about some mm -hmm. shit. Mm -hmm. Fuck with it. That's mm -hmm. true, true. So it's true. only been eight months, man. Just talk about like how your life has kind of changed, like Facts. within eight months, because that's like I swear to God, short time. My life changed the same day. Damn. I, I flew. I flew to Miami the same morning. Mm. Like, like uh, when damn. I woke up and found out it, it it blew up, I flew out to Miami like the next morning. So it blew wow. up like, in one day. You feel like that's, that's hard. Right. Like, like that's like hard. Eight hours, it had like a hundred. Like talking about the Glock, baby. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Like in eight hours, it was at like four hours. It was like fifty-four k. Like, so is that just so word of mouth? You think, or did you have like, like how did the this shit spread? Because I know you said he did that, which mm -hmm. obviously helped a lot. But um, yeah, like I think word of mouth is still a very big thing. Oh, yeah, and like when somebody reposts something, they share that to their thousands mm -hmm. of friends. But Everybody do you just was sharing it like. All of his people were sharing it. Everybody went crazy on his channel. And then everybody in Dallas, my people were like, damn, he blowing up too. Like, And all of it happened in a couple of hours. So everybody in Dallas You was acting it. brand new the next day. I nigga was like, what? <laughs> I don't know you. Don't nah, I my still act the same. I still be on the block and everything on right. God. I still be in the hood. Like when I go to Dallas, I don't be like, how I be in the hood every day. Mm, yeah, so it's but, like, I, I ain't really changed. I think that's why I can keep making music the same. Because I'm still living the same way. I ain't trying to do nothing different. Yeah. Just trying yeah. to stay true to myself. True. So true. you didn't do no other plan, marketing plan, or nothing. You put it out organically, and it just did with it. Yeah. That's lit. That's dope. That's how some things work. When you just when you ain't thinking Facts. so far into it, you just like just off the strength. And then you like, might be thinking mad hard for another yeah. project and don't even do it with the. Facts. But I like one thing you said. You know, you he said, look, he looking, looking for, for his that backwards. wood. <laughs> Bro, Where's what's the up? Wood? Yo, I low key want to hit that joint right now. This is a oh like, yeah. Don't here, worry, y'all. This, this is normal. We do this on it's the progress report. Work, I'll be right back. We progressing <laughs> and we smoking. Okay, we progressively smoking. No, here, just, <laughs> not so, here. Not here. Like, hmm. <laughs> my bad. My bad. Not no, you like good. That. You good. We just smoking. No, we fucking. No, 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 don't, no, don't pay no, us no attention, man. We just silly. No, no, we we just talking shit. We just silly, man. Don't listen to our asses. So look, so who you um who you come up listening to? You know, like shit. We are a couple of years older than you, so I'm always curious to know, like you know, shit. I'm old, so I can't listen to. So so who? My favorite, like my favorite, like comparison right now, like I'm 
I grew up listening to uh, Life Genius. Oh, I say, shit. I say Rod Wave that. sound a lot like him to me. Like, okay. Same, that's like, what's up. Uh, that's what's up. That. Like, I like me Michael neither. Jackson. I feel like that's what like, okay. a lot of Young Thug and Roddy Rich style come Definitely. from. Definitely. Like, Michael Jackson started that to me. Like, nice. I listen to Chief Keef, of course. Like, bye, bye. Yeah, like Sosa really started that drill shit. Like, Absolutely. Yeah, no, that's Shout facts. Shout out to Chief Keith. I listen to a lot of people, though, like just growing up, like. That's what's up. It's, it's endless names. Kanye West, that college dropout, like. I like that. Nipsey Hussle, big, like. Mm. Back when he had the Ace Town. Yeah, like. Okay. Yeah, King like, Nip. I like that. I like I like when, you know, people actually do their research and, you know, just listen to the people that came before them. You know what I mean? So I yeah. respect that. I respect yeah, yeah. that a lot, man. Um, talk about your name, though. How'd you get that name? Lil Loaded? Oh. Mm. <laughs> I don't know if I can guess why, but uh, <laughs> can I guess why? Nah, multiple <laughs> reasons, though. They first started calling me, like, I was, I was, I used to go to the basketball court, and then, like, niggas just not want to give me my fouls because I was little. Just got to stop going for that. <laughs> nah, I ain't to the court loaded. I'm not going for that. <laughs> and then, like, I was playing football. I had just... I had just started going to school because I used to, I had moved I moved back from over here back to the West Coast back from Dallas to the West Coast and then came back yeah. so when I come back they ain't like I'm I'm just now in high school and stuff so we kicking in the shit everybody like, I'm coming to practice high as fuck like <laughs> coach looking at me knowing I'm loaded oh, everybody coach. just start calling me little loaded. okay I that's funny okay. I thought otherwise but right I know I'm like it go one or two ways <laughs> um so with music you just signed the deal not too long ago correct. Talk about that. I signed with Epic. Okay. That was big for me. Hell yeah. Because I went to a lot, of, a lot of label meetings. Like for me, I'm sure you did. When I went on the meetings, I was like, I just turned 19. Like I ain't even get to, I ain't graduate. Like I dropped out. I ain't graduate. But like mm. that, I would have graduated. That's the time I would have graduated. So mm. like everybody else going on their college tours, I'm, I'm visiting labels and shit. That shit. That's my favorite experience. That's like, hard. Cause like it was the perfect time and like everybody in my class going to visit colleges and I'm going to visit labels mm. at the same time. I'm just having fun. Like, <laughs> I just bet. Just enjoying the experience. And uh, Epic just seemed the most genuine with me. And it was a, mm. it was a, like I had, I felt like they really like believe in me. So. The best mm. intro. Yeah. Well, it's, Go ahead. Oh, okay. I was going to say, well, you know, just speaking of just uh, contracts and just everything like that, you know, are you doing your due diligence as an artist and as a businessman, just making sure that you're reading what you're getting yourself into? Oh, most definitely. Most definitely. I, I got lawyers and stuff. But at the same time, I'm not going to sit there and read all that. But I read a little <laughs> bit of it, like stuff that I, I might find important, like a broad topic. I ask him about it. He'll tell me what part he's in. Oh, okay. that's what we just talked about. <laughs> yeah, we, yeah, we did. This right here means... Uh, yeah. <laughs> you see, but... He'll tell me that. I'll be like, so what, what about this? What they do with this? Mm. And then I just see what it is on there and then just. You know That's what, what the lawyers is for. They first, know what to look right. out for. My first contract, boy. <laughs> they tried to get you. No, nah, they ain't even try to get me. Like, it's my manager right now. Oh, okay, my bad. My manager, great dude. <laughs> my great bad. dude. Nah, great dude. Like, he really is. Like, but I ain't know that. Like, yeah. I came. I noticed he was real with me when I came. Mm. I ain't playing a sign, but I noticed like how, how real he was. Like, mm. he was telling me, like, yeah, like it's expenses here, here, and here. So like, mm. you know what okay, I'm so he was up front. I respect that. Yeah, okay, you know what I'm yeah. So it was like, so it was like, yeah, I just signed with him. I didn't even look at it. I just signed with it. And oh, just went with that it. ain't and good it, though, man. And it went good for me. But see, I got like, I could feel his energy. Like it was a genuine. But you nigga. can't say that because that's the same thing Megan said. Yo, that's family. Da da da. And and like these people that you can really be fucking cool with. And I'm not saying you, man. I'm just saying in general as far as no, artists. I already know. Oh, um, that. Like, yeah, they could be looking out for the best of you and really believe in you, but still have split shit 50-50. Hey, yeah, that, that's that's a, that's a big thing. It is. It do happen. It could happen to me easily. I ain't look at that. Like, I, 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 I talk to him about it. That's it. Yeah. I ain't look at that shit. But, like, shit, I'm, I'm a young nigga, 18. I'm talking about yeah. nigga on the block every day. What? You put 50 bands in my face. Yeah, yeah. And that's what a lot of them <laughs> say. And it ain't, no, it ain't no major deal. Like, I can't. He's still my manager now. You feel yeah, me? Sure. It wasn't and like, that's, and that's it wasn't like I'm a sign to him and can't go nowhere else. Yeah. Yeah. And, you know what I'm saying? And, and finish with who the hell you start with. I respect yeah, that shit. Especially right when they, they show, like, you show love. You know what I'm Damn saying? Damn right. Of course, it's business, so he's going to be fair to yourself. Of course. It's fair to me, too. So at the end of the day, if we all eat, what's the problem? Absolutely. Thanks. That's the fact. So why should people check you out? Like, say, for instance, you know, somebody ain't never heard you before. Why should they check you out? If you want good quality music, you want to turn up, like, <laughs> go listen to me. I'm lit. Like, and it's genuine. You know, a nigga really living what he rap about. Like, Okay, you black really, baby. But just have fun with the music regardless. Like, my music good. Like, that's how I feel about it. I'm genuine. I'm going to give you 
the real, you can feel it. Mm-hmm. True, true, true. Uh, we like to ask everybody to come to the show to define the word progress. You know, that's the name of the show, the progress prayer, excelling, going up, you know, going to new levels. What does the word progress mean to you? Hey, I ain't going to lie. Right now, this this is a good experience for me because I feel like right now it will be my progress report. It mm-hmm. ain't my report cards yet, yeah. but it's my progress report. Like, On I'm progressing up. so fast right now. It's like, y'all getting the levels, and I feel like progress is just taking steps. Even if it's a lesson, you might feel like it's – you might feel like you're stepping back, but you're learning a lesson, so you won't even have to go through that again. So anytime, anytime you're getting an experience, it's progress to me. Facts. Like, that's why I hate being in jail on God. Mm. Like, niggas outside doing shit, like, progressing every day, and I'm in this whole life. Mm. That's why. So that's what progress is to me, just learning new stuff. Like, True. Getting, better at your tra- getting better at your craft and learning <laughs> outside trap. stuff. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> hey, goofy. That's what's up, Hey, man. now I like you, man. Your energy cool as hell, man. You funny as shit. <laughs> but let them know your social media and spell it out, too. Where can they find you at? You follow me on Instagram at loaded underscore official. The own official is a zero. You're going to have to find it, though. You yeah. got like six pages that came up when I typed your name, man. I'm like, damn, is it There's this so many one? fan pages yeah, and fake pages. Like, yeah. But yours got the zero as the O. Oh. Uh-huh. Okay, got it. Cool. Appreciate y'all for having me. Absolutely, Thank you, man. Mr. Parker Spur, we out. We ain't stay at nine. Tune in every time. We don't do no cap. Report only facts. Parker's report. We got the news. New interviews. We got the stats. Keep it a rack. Don't join the pack. Know where we at. We ain't stay at nine. Tune in every time. We don't do no 